So these people I, I've written about, Mangena, they are mentioned in many historical books, but as a one-liner and a footnote, but also as politicians. What is not mentioned is their intellectual contribution to the development of the jurisprudence in South Africa and in England. There's a case called Mangena versus the Times. That is the case where Mangena sued Mdolombo for making defamatory statements against him, but the newspaper that published the defamatory statements was the Times, Times of England. That case is still being read today in the law of thoughts. If you go to Oxford or Cambridge or London School of Economics, you look for a book on the law of thoughts. One of the cases you'll be prescribed is Mangena versus the Times. But nobody knows who Mangena was and what was the context of the story, right? So that level of contributions to world literature, you know, it is just totally forgotten, you know, and uh, unknown. My name is Tembeka Mugai Tobi. I'm a lawyer, practice as an advocate. I sometimes write, uh, mainly I write in legal history, uh, in constitutional history, and in land history. I'm obviously interested in topics of how the law was imposed from Europeans to Africans, but more interested in how Africans made of the imposition and how they reacted to colonial conquest. And that's been the subject of my study and interest for many years.